Hey, so I saw this tweet from Lou from Open Up the Cloud asking about if networking or Linux is kind of necessary to know before entering the cloud space or if you're trying to get into cloud, is Linux and networking necessary? So here's the actual tweet, you know, uh, it does ask only about networking, but I did see his Instagram version of this question where he asked about both Linux and networking. And my personal take on this is gonna be that it'll really help you if you know networking and Linux, right? Uh, the, the learning curve becomes less uh, when you're entering cloud. And this is my personal opinion. Again, uh, people can disagree to this. But what I have found is not only being a cloud engineer in the past, but now that I'm teaching cloud in, in an institute, I feel like, you know, if you have to understand VPC, with, because I'm teaching AWS, so VPC is virtual private cloud, and I had to do a refresher on, you know, how IP addresses work and how subnetting works. And which means if you kind of know how networks work, it, it's pretty easy to grasp that knowledge and to understand how VPCs work, right? Whereas it could be a bit tricky if you're not familiar with how networking works. And that's what I'm saying is the learning curve can become, you know, a bit steep and you have to kind of learn about networking on the go compared to if you are already familiar with some of the foundational concepts of networking it will be easy to understand these concepts which are in cloud basically which you might have seen on prem or you know just how in general networking would work and similarly for linux too i feel like linux is the most common VM or you know virtual server that I spin up in AWS Azure or GCP and hence I guess knowing Linux would help you a lot so I was really kind of can say lucky because Linux and networking both were part of the curriculum for the diploma that I took so when I started learning cloud it was really easy to understand like what SSH means, how you know SSH protocol works, what were some commands that are used kind of daily, where are some important files. So you know Linux directories like EDC where configurations exist, and then you have var slash log where most of the log files are. So having that foundational knowledge I think really helped and I felt more comfortable when learning cloud. So yeah, that's that's my kind of two cents on these question that Lou had. But yeah, I think having foundational knowledge about Linux and networking would help you a lot. And I think, you know, you should start there if you're entering cloud.